What's up, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon Emerald, the insanely randomized Nuzlocke, episode number four. In the last episode, which was yesterday, we made our way through Petalburg Woods, picking up a new Pokemon along the way, and then made it all the way here to Rustboro City, taking out all the trainers along the, that route. I think it's Route 4 that we took out. So if you want to check out the last episode, and if you did miss that, go ahead and click the, uh, the I card just above, and it'll take you straight to that. Now, in today's episode, uh, we got here to Rustboro City, like I said, and I actually already started this episode uh, once before, and um, I was wrong in what I thought we were going to do. So this episode, we're actually taking on the first gym, uh, which is pretty crazy. I didn't know we were already to the first gym. It's only episode 4. Um, so it seems like this LP is going to go pretty quick, which is fine. Um, but yeah, so we're doing that today. So if you're excited for more Pokemon Emerald, go and hit that like button down below. It helps out so much. Subscribe if you're new, because obviously that helps out. And uh, let's go ahead and get into it with a team recap. Now, you will have seen a grinding montage just before this. Again, I wanted to train up just a little bit so that our team can handle it. Um, so first up, we have... Rohan, our level 15 Psychic Steel Magikarp with Liquid Ooze, which I now understands what it does. I understand what Liquid Ooze does. Uh, and Quirky Nature, his stats are there. Pretty good, over pretty well-rounded at least. Uh, Megahorn, he did learn Metal Claw just here at level 15. So then we have Navena, our level 15 Normal Bug-type Gorobus with Magma Armor, Careful Nature. Stats there, pretty good, minus that special defense and special attack. With Air Cutter, which is that? Oh, it's still on the whole type thing. Okay, that's... So then that makes this an, a, a physical move. Okay, uh, which is good. Swagger and Smokescreen we just learned. And then we have Oscar, our Fire-type Sceptile with Shell Armor, Naughty Nature. Stats there, pretty good, minus that special defense. Um... <clears throat> Oh, with Flame Wheel, Mudshot, Uproar, and Sacred Fire, you can see there. And then, of course, we have our Rena, the level 5 normal flying Stantler. Timid Nature, which is pretty good with Blaze. Uh, stats are there. I, I, didn't, I didn't train Rhea up. I don't even know why. I hope we don't wind up needing Rhea, but I would totally let Rhea die. Uh, <laughs> for the greater good. Anyway, uh, I'm pretty sure. So, like I said, I, I did this... I started playing through this once before, and uh, so I'm pretty sure I know where all the important stuff is, and we're just going to go through that super quick. Now, question of the day, which you can see uh, down below, whoops, that way, down below the game, um, you can see the question of the day, and it's going to be, who is your favorite gym leader in Hoenn, and why? So you got to let me know in the comments below, and again, something like a comment and a like on a video, this is why YouTubers ask this in every single video, you like and comment it. And of course subscribe but it really helps out so much because then YouTube thinks that the video is doing a good job which hopefully it is uh, and you know then then it's it gets recommended to more people etc etc uh, this is our Pikachu anyway so let's talk about gym leaders and Hoenn uh, actually hold on this is not the place I want to be yes it is yes it is all right so let me talk to this guy so in Hoenn we have Roxanne uh, who's not bad, but she's just like a kid. I mean, just a kid with some rock types. Uh, whoops. So I'm gonna give that Quick Claw to my Magikarp, Rohan, because he is the slowest of our, uh, three-party team. Three-man team, okay, I'm, I'm like, pressing wrong buttons because I'm not holding the speed up button. I'm so used to speeding up. Anyway. Uh, let's talk to Sky here real quick. Hello, didn't we meet before? I think back in Petalburg City. Let me introduce myself. My name's Scott. I've been traveling everywhere in search of outstanding trainers. More specifically, I'm looking for Pokemon battle experts. So what brings you to this school? Are you a trainer too? First thing you should do is have a Pokemon learn the move Cut. If I remember correctly, someone in this town has Cut. Alright, Scott. We'll see you next time. Alright, uh, and then let's go talk to this guy. Again, I saw this earlier, but just so you can sit... Oh, I'm in the wrong place. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to go up to this house. This is the guy. Yeah, this is the guy. 
He said, huh, my Pokemon's cute. Sure, I knew that, but if you really want, I'm going to trade it to you. I'll trade you my Scyther for a Cloyster. So if I get a Scyther, no. If I get a Cloyster, I have to remember to go there. All right, so I think we're ready to run up in Rustboro. Uh, oh, wait, let's go up here and get our item from up here. <laughs> um, so Roxanne doesn't really overwhelm me. I haven't really thought about this, so um, second is Brawly. Brawly's pretty cool. You know, the fighting, fighting, and like he works out, he's in the gym all the time, etc. Et so I could go with Brawly. I would certainly pick Brawly over Roxanne. Let's go ahead into Roxanne's gym. Uh, who are we leading with today? Let's go ahead and lead Rohan. I do want to get Rohan close to evolving. That'd be great. Oh, uh, and then there's, what's his name? The third guy. You have a level 11 Cinequio. Cinequio. Oh, I should have used Metal Claw. That's okay. Um, what's his name? Ice Ball. That does uh, that does one. Yeah, I thought so. I right, just go with Metal Claw. Um, what's his name? I cannot think of his name. Of course, you got a crit. Um, this is gonna bother me. Hold on. Let's see if Siri knows. Who's the third gym leader in the Hoenn region? Okay, I found this on the web for who's the third gym leader in the Hoenn region. Hold on. Hold on. She gives, she gives me a link. What if I, what if I correct her spelling? Okay, I found this on the web for who's the third gym leader in the Hone region. Mobile City. His name's not Chuck, is it? Wait, okay, hold on. I'm gonna... Mobile City. Watson. I feel like I should have known that. Uh, so obviously Watson's not my favorite. <laughs> um... I'm thinking about it. who is my favorite but Watson I think in the in Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire Watson totally like also I know I'm going to trigger at least one person in the comments below not remembering uh, Watson's name but anyway um, in the in Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire when like he smacks his belly before you start battling I think that totally just turns me off of him Sunflora and Spinarak all right, um, so we're gonna go Metal Claw and Sunflora, and we're just gonna use Air Cutter, which attacks both of them. Um, Flannery is a new gym leader, so it's kind of hard to give her to, to give her the favorite. But I like her better than everybody so far, I think. Signal Beam, uh, Torment. Now I can't use the same move twice. Okay. So now I have to use Megahorn. If that's really what you want, I mean, if you really want me to use Megahorn, I guess I will. Uh, um, and then we have Norman. I don't like Norman. Uh, Winona is probably my favorite gym leader in Hoenn. Or Wallace. It's not going to be Tate and Liz. Is it Liz? Tate and Liza, maybe? One of those two? Um... Uh, it's, it's one of those two names. I don't exactly remember which. Also, I don't like the way double battles just worked. He sent his Pokemon in mid-battle. Wait, 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 wait. Go for... Yeah, I guess I'll go for... I guess I'll do this. Um, so Winona's probably my favorite gym leader because, like I said in episode two... Oh, gosh, I recorded these. I recorded them over the weekend, and it's currently... What's today? Wednesday? Breaking the fourth wall a little bit. But, um... I talked about how the stretch from Mauville Town, or Mauville City, up to Fortree City. Wait, Sacred Fire? Well. We have our first death. And that sucks. 
And there's nothing I there's nothing I could have done. I how am I supposed to know that he has sacred fire? What? Ah! Uh, why does a love disc have sacred fire? I was so unconcerned, I wasn't even focused. I just barely saw sacred fire out of the corner of my eye. God dang it. Well, I guess we're gonna go ahead and rename this. Wait, where's the colon? I need a colon! Okay, I can't do it. That's so sad! Uh, Rohan! No, don't release. What did I say? I said that my team was going to lose to something special because our special defense is low. Five more levels and you were going to probably evolve into a dark rye. Oh, I don't I don't want to look. I don't want to go look at what it's going to evolve into. I don't want to go look at what it's going to evolve into. It make me way too sad. All right. Who's the slower of these two? Wow, it is definitely Oscar. All right, Oscar, hold this uh hey. Hold this quick claw. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. I didn't think we had anything to worry about in this gym. <sighs> I guess that's what I get for not saying that Roxanne was my favorite, huh? Alright, so let's go ahead and stand next to Roxanne. Actually, I'm going to stand here. Because it will look a lot better for the thumbnail if I do it this way. So let's go ahead and take on Roxanne with our shortened team... Uh, it's so annoying. All right. Hello, I'm Roxanne, the Rustboro Pokemon City Gym Leader. I became a gym leader so that I might apply what I learned at the Pokemon Trainer School in battle. Would you kindly demonstrate how you battle and with which Pokemon? I would love to show you my starter, Roxanne. You know, the starter that everyone watching helped me choose. I would really love to, but your stupid trainers took it out. Why is Kingler in the air? Get out of the air! What you doing up there? And this has overheat! No! <laughs> no! She, she wasn't ready! She wasn't ready. This is where Kevin Hart comes in. He wasn't ready. In fact, I might edit that in. Trying to learn Sky Attack? Over what? Uproar? It's a two attack. No, it's a turn. A two turn move. Get out of here. Yes. Stop wearing sky attack. I am so upset. You have a Jirachi. Hold this sacred fire. Why does everything know sacred fire? I need to know. Everything knows sacred fire. Rock slide? That probably would have just killed me. Okay. This is not going like I hoped. Honestly, I'm about to stream. I was hoping I could just, you know, jump in and, and play a quick episode of Pokemon Emerald. And this is what I get. Psybeam. That's special. Am I dead? Of course you have an Orenberry. If I miss, I die. 
You know what? I've said that far too many times in the past two LPs, and I've died. I'm healing. I'm going to get confused, but I'm going for it. Thank you. Please kill it. If it holds on and I lose, I can't believe this. It's like I'm playing actual Pokemon Emerald. All I have left... No, you can't learn Covet? What do you want to learn Covet for? Uh. <laughs> ah, okay. So, I lost. It seems I still have much more to learn. I understand. The Pokemon League's rules state that trainers are to be given this if they defeat a gym leader. Please accept the official Pokemon League stone badge. You know what, Roxanne? I don't feel accomplished. At all! The stone badge heightens the attack power of your Pokemon. It also enables them to use the HM move cut outside of battle. Please take this with you too. This better be like... I don't even know. This better be something powerful. Bone Club? Roxanne, why? I'm sorry that I said I didn't really like you. Get out! Get out of the way! Wait, please! Don't take my goods! <laughs> Can you imagine how that scene actually looks? You see, t you see t a Team Aqua guy run away, probably carrying something that he's stealing, and you see the Devons researcher following him. No! Give me back that stuff! And then you see this, gym, this trainer that just beat the gym leader run the opposite direction. Just gone. <laughs> Well, <sighs> Nevena, you just just weren't ready. <laughs> we just weren't ready today. I thought 15 would be okay, but of course, freaking everything has sacred fire. Well, uh, we are going to keep the episode going just a bit. Um, just a couple more minutes. We're at about 17 and a half-ish minutes. Obviously, you know this, but... All right, well, we have Oscar. So, wahoo. Yay. Got to catch another Pokemon? Oh, it's you. You're the fantastic trainer who helped me in Petalburg Woods. Help me, I was robbed by Team Aqua. I have to get the Devon Goods back. If I don't, I'm going to be in serious trouble. Got you, my bro. I got you, my dude. Uh, Rhea, I need you to lead. Okay, Rhea. And, and here's the thing. We have to catch this Pokemon. Oh, oh, it's an Umbreon. Oh, that's so hype. Oh, I'm so happy. If you saw episode two, you should remember that I said I really wanted an Umbreon. All right, let me go and shift because there's just no reason for me to do that. All right, um, what's the strategy here? I'm a lot higher level than this. Maybe I should have stayed in. I'm gonna switch back because that doesn't really do like too much. All right, and now this. I, I think I think Umbreon is worth it. We just need to get it a little lower. Hyper Fang. No, 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 no. No, no, no. You go for double edge. You go for double edge. Okay. What oh, has flame body? All right, there's no reason for me to do anything else because I don't think I'm going to get it low enough. So cross your fingers. Everybody cross your fingers with me, please. Come on. Ooh, that's bad. All right, I'm going to go ahead and switch now because there's no reason for me to just be out there dying. All right, fingers crossed, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. 
Come on, Umbreon, be on the team, please. I love you. You're my favorite Pokemon. Okay, I lied. That's why you didn't stay in. I didn't mean to say a favorite. You're one of my favorites. Join Oscar. Okay. All right, we're just going to hold the speed up button. All right, let's throw our one Great Ball. Maybe I should hold. Maybe I should have saved that. I am not playing very smart right now. All right, all right, regroup, regroup. I do not have anything that heals. I have everything else except the one that heals burn. That sucks. Okay. Uh, so instead, do I happen to have... No. What do I do here? What's the play? What's the proper play? Okay, now I'm gonna switch. This is the best that it's gonna get. If we if we catch it, we catch it. If we don't, well, so close. Stay, 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 stay. Umbreon, come on. Umbreon, please make this episode better. Umbreon, please, come on, stay, please. Oh my gosh, it's not gonna stay. It's not gonna stay. This will all be for a waste. Ah! Wow. Wow. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and run back. That's a rough episode. I was actually planning on recording two episodes before I streamed, and now I, I, there's absolutely no way I can record. I'm gonna have to train up Rhea. Well, this turned out horrible. But anyway, we are gonna go ahead and call that an episode. So if you did enjoy this episode and you feel bad for our fallen friends, go and hit that like button down below. Answer the comments of the day, which is your favorite starter in Hoenn in the comments below. I'll be sure to respond to all of those. And we will see you tomorrow for the next episode of Pokemon Emerald, the insanely randomized Nuzlocke, which is turning out to be insane. But until then, have a blessed day.